This is NASA's hyperson hypersonic sled track. Watch it. Can't even see it, right? You can't fathom this speed, let alone twice this speed. You have to believe, if you believe in the heliocentric system, that we're on a lumpy rock surrounded by smir smooth, curved water that never shows convexity, surrounded by high-pressure air, adjacent to no-pressure vacuum of space, which violates natural law, and we're moving around the sun 10 times faster than this. And we're chasing the sun a hundred times faster than this, right? But when we go out into nature, in the natural world, use our common sense, what do we see? We see perfectly flat, calm water. This isn't moving in four different directions at once in curved trajectories in all different directions. This is a stationary earth. We live on a topographical stationary level, non-rotating plane. Angel, throw something again, and then we'll go to, right to questions. Because can, we can talk all day about this, but I want to get to your globe proofs. Because if you believe we live on the globe, there must be a reason other than that's what the textbook said.